Hello and welcome back to our channel. I am Farwa and you're watching Ninja Iraqi Dinar News on YouTube channel. Hopefully you all are doing fine. Let's get started today. I don't think Iraq is going to have a deficit ever again. I think they're going to move beyond that by far with all the income streams they've got coming online. And once they change the value of their currency, they won't be tapping into their dollar reserves anymore. Those reserves are just going to grow, and they're going to grow big. Not to mention the money they've been clawing back over the last year or so. They were estimating $450 billion. That's going to be clawed back. Iraq is not going to be a poor country. It's going to be filthy rich. Released from their sanctions, that's what we're really waiting for. So even if we woke up in the morning and found out that the Iraqi dinar had been reinstated to 322, hallelujah, we're rich, right? Jumping around, celebrating. But where are you going to redeem your dinar if they are still under sanctions? Your options are going to be very limited here in the United States. Chase Bank still deals with the Iraqi dinars, but not a lot of other companies or banks do just because of the sanctions. Will they be released from their sanctions before the revaluation? Or if they do an RI, will they be released from their sanctions? Remember, Sudani told the citizens, In a week, I will announce and introduce a new banking service that will decline the USD. That equals to an increase in the Iraqi dinar. He said it. Iraqis called over extremely early in the AM. They are excited about the lower dinams. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more new videos.